Hello, hello, Sagittarius, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today, I am doing a bonus reading for you because you came out in... I, I actually took six of the highest signs, and guess what? You were there So um, for, the, for the last month. So here you go. This is your bonus read. Please, Universal Energy, Spirit Guides, Ancestors, please bring forward three oracle messages for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please, Universal Energies. All right, here we go. Okay, so we have here Water Guardian. Connect with your emotions. For some of you, this could be a water sign. You know, this could be you. I mean, maybe one of your placements, you know, feelings. Feelings, that's what I hear. Shape shifter. Shape shifter. Transform and unveil your gifts. Love it. Take off your veil. Take off your, your, your black veil. Show yourself. You know, and, and just accept everything that you, the universe brings in for you. And here we go. Mother Nate. I was going to say Mother Nature. It's actually Mother Earth. Feel love and comfort it. I can't remember. Another sign got this for the bonus read. I can't remember which one it was. But anyway, here we go. Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors. Please bring forward. Three messages for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is a bonus read. Please, Universal Energy, Spirit Guides, Ancestors, please bring forward. Bella is with me, so you will hear her oinking and grunting. <laughs> please, Universal Energy, Spirit Guides, Ancestors, please bring forward. Come on. Wake up. Three messages. There we go. I think I got one in here. Yep. Seven of cups. Seven of cups. Choices. Possibilities. Worshipping something. Okay. Um, I feel like for some of you, there's somebody here that may not be that happy. Okay. Here we go. Let's see. Oh, my God. You know what? I was going to say something, and I said, I'm not going to say it, and here it is. I was going to say, this looks like the Empress, right? And here's the Empress. Now I wish I would have said it when I, when I looked at it, because the, the Empress is also a pregnant woman, okay? It's a, it's a woman that nurtures herself, takes care of herself. So some of you, listen, some of you could be starting a business. I'm going to tell you right now. And the reason that I say that is because you have here the eight of pentacles, right? So with the eight of pentacles, this is um, working on something really hard, working on your money, money coming in for you, you know, um, having a dream that you're going to and be sitting back enjoying the fruits of your labor. All of a sudden, you're here getting choices, possibilities, options. You're, and you're like, what's going on? What do I pick? I'm so confused. I'm so lost. Can I have some help? And here is the Empress. Okay, so this may be, for some of you, listen, you could, if you, I'm going to say it, if you do not want to be pregnant, okay, you have one businesswoman here and a pregnant woman. However, they're both women that bring things into fruition, bring things to life. So let me tell you something. If you are not looking to have a baby, keep your pants on and keep your skirts closed, okay? Sew them up, do something, all right? Um, okay, Sagittarius, let me see. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Please, Universal Energies, Spirit Guides, Ancestors. Why is the Seven of Cups? Seven of Cups. And listen, the Empress can also be a man, okay? It doesn't necessarily mean it's a woman, all right? 
Please, universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors. Okay, here we go. Knight of Pentacles. Long ass motherfucking time. Okay, this person thinks that you got all motherfucking day to make a decision. You know, this person has left you a little heartbroken or somebody here is heartbroken. Somebody here could have brought in a third party. Why? Because listen, they had choices. They, they took their sweet ass time to get to you and that fucking broke your heart. Look at the scream on this woman. All right, we're going to clarify these. Please, universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors. There we go. Eight of pentacles. Holy shit. Not once, but twice. So listen, some of you put a lot of work into this. You put a lot of your fucking energy. You know, you know sometimes we give way too much in a relationship that is not giving us back the same thing. You know? All right, let's see. Please, universal energies. You're looking for love. You're looking for love. You're looking for money. Some of you are going to be successful. I want you to see this, okay? In the past, some of you were working on this. You were working on soulmate energy. However, this person turned out to not be the person that you thought. You also have here the queen of pentacles. So I feel that a lot of you are thinking about who am I going to share my time with? Listen, this person in the past, you know, in the present, they, they hurt you. They took their time to get to you. They made you second choice. All right? This is for some of you. Now, everybody's going to have the same thing. Please, universal energies. And some of you, you know what? You're like, you know what? I, you know, you could have been grieving. You could have been mourning. But I'll tell you right now, when you used to go to work, you used to look like this. Nobody knew that you were going through the dark night of the soul. Everybody saw you as, you know, the, the empress. I'm going to tell you that, you know, this is, uh, when I see the queen of pentacles, this could also be an empress. Why? Because listen, look at the little horns coming out of her head. Okay. This is creation. This is something that could be materialistic. This is something that grows. Okay. But with the five of cups, there could literally, you know, this person could have hurt you in the past. You know, you have probably regrets. You're feeling a little bit type of loss. They could be feeling lost that they lost you. You know, take it as it fits. Not everybody's going to have the same story. You know, why is, let's see, the five of cups here. Okay, we got two cards. I'm going to take both of them. Okay, I don't do reversals in case you saw me turn those cards over. Okay, Sagittarius. Okay, Sagittarius, listen. You were able to embrace the world, okay, with the sun and then with the Knight of Cups here. Some of you were able to um, make an offer or somebody wanting to make you an offer. You know, I just don't feel that this offer was for you. I don't feel that the offer was big enough for you because you know what? You're the fucking queen, Okay. Um, this person who is young and immature, they stopped somewhere and they got some cheap ass flowers and they brought them to you. Like even like, it doesn't even have a fucking vase in it. Okay. Why? Because listen, they are not to your standard. Okay. Period. Please universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward. Okay. Here we go. Nine, nine of cups, king of swords. Looking for your happiness, making a decision, okay? Making a fucking decision, all right? Cold, all right? Manipulative, this person could, could have been, you know, this could be you. Um, you know, with the nine of cups, this is, you know, the universe granting your wishes. You know, they, I feel that this is you. I just feel like you were dealing with somebody who was just not up to your standard, you know? Um, I feel that these two cards, between these two cards, I feel like there's a lot of enlightening for you, you know, enlightenment. I feel like there is something here that's going to start brand new. I feel that some of you are going to start a brand new money opportunity. Some of you may be very optimistic that some of you listen with the Empress here. Some of you may be in the beginning stages of starting a fucking huge business. Okay, that's what I feel. Let me get one more for the outcome. One more. And the three of wands. Some of you may be traveling, 
looking across the water, making certain decisions, looking at the vision, giving somebody your back. Okay, listen, I forgot. I got to clear this up. Three of Swords. Why is it here? Three of Swords. Ace of Swords. Listen, there was a truth that was revealed. Okay, there was a truth that was revealed and this fucking broke your heart. This truth broke your heart. So you know what? Nurture yourself, take care of yourself and do yourself a favor and understand that you are way too much person for this other person who's coming across as immature, okay? And very hurtful, you know, and taking their time about getting to you, all right? Listen, shift that change, all right? Thank you so much for being here, Sagittarius, and take care.